things haven't quite gone as some fans would have hoped or expected for the Minnesota Twins. Minnesota has played seven games, winning three and losing four. The team currently sits in fifth in the AL Central standings, already finding themselves three games back from the Cleveland Guardians. The Twins were supposed to close out its three-game series against Cleveland yesterday afternoon. However, Mother Nature had other plans. Minnesota opened with a 2-1 series win over Kansas City before splitting its series in Milwaukee with the Brewers. This weekend's series against the Guardians was the team's first series at Target Field and had lost both on Friday and Saturday. The Twins will return to action this evening at home against the L.A. Dodgers. Many West Region baseball teams began their seasons this past week, and few have gotten off to a better start than the Mandan Braves. After the first week of action, the Braves have posted a 5-1 record, including two series sweeps. Head coach DeWitt Max says the standard is high after winning the West Region tournament last season. Well, the, the bar is high. It's high for this group of boys. Um, they're going to have to work hard to get to that again. Um, there, there are no slouch teams in the West, so it, it's going to be a, a challenge. Uh, I think we, if we put our minds to it and work hard all season, we'll be a, a contender again. Minot and Legacy have also had a great first week of baseball. The Magicians are 4-0 while the Sabres are 4-1. The Braves are back in action today with a doubleheader against St. Mary's. Now one of my favorite events of the summer is the North Dakota Lions basketball game. It's when the Class B schools get to face off against the Class A schools in a two-game series. This time around, due to the three-class system, the Class A and B schools will be teaming up to take on the AA schools. The teams for this summer's games were announced this afternoon. Stars on the AA boys team include Isaiah Schaefer from Century, Damon Glosser from Dickinson, Williston's Isaiah St. Romain and Legacy's Lucas Kupfer, and Minot's Logan Conklin. West Fargo Cheyenne's Tim Brandt will be the coach alongside North's Travis Hogue. That team will face off against Mr. Basketball recipient Dang Dang, plus the likes of Bishop and Bowden Duffield from Bowman County, Hazen's Tyson Wick, Javin Freeze from Flasher, and Atticus Wilkinson from Shiloh. Anthony Lee and Dustin Brodina will lead the AB boys. Bill Shetler and Tona Safronsky will lead the AA girls. They'll have a roster that includes Paige Brewer and Jersey Berg from BHS, Eden Fridley, Jaden Wiest and Haley Markle from Mandan, and Miss Basketball recipient Jocelyn Schiller. Shiloh's Deidre Wood, along with Watford City's Jessica Mogan, EKM's Matea Mathern, and Bowman County's J.C. Fisher will play for the AB girls team. Game 1 will take place at Bismarck High on July 15th, and Game 2 will be July 16th at Fargo South High School.